to my channel so for today's video it's gonna be a very chill and relaxed video I think I'm just gonna film a little bit of blue for you guys he is making a lot of noise and climbing around right now as you can probably hear whenever he hears me in here he goes wild boo boo you make a noise so as you guys know I am at pet fest this weekend for about three days so I don't have a lot of time to film this week so I'm probably only going to be able to put up about three videos for you guys this week. I know I normally post four and I'm really sorry, but I think three is the best I can do under the circumstances of me not being home. So today we're just going to take Blue outside. We're going to relax with him, going to soak him, and we're going to feed him. And I thought that I would film all of that for you guys because he's so adorable and I know you guys love him as much as I do. I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, feel free to subscribe down below and hit the notification bell. All right, I think he's definitely ready to go. He is so energized and crawling all over the place. Okay, let's go. All right, so we're gonna pick some food for baby Blue for him to eat after he's done with his soap. We're gonna just get some clover from over here. I always have lots of clover grow in this part of the garden. We're gonna get a few leaves of this plantain. He loves plantain and plantain's really good for them. It's a dandelion. All right, we're out here with baby blue. We're giving him a good soak right now and then we're gonna take him out and he will be able to eat. It's such a pretty day outside so we're gonna give him some good sunshine. Yeah, look a baby. This is what it's like having a tortoise. Taking care of them and soaking them and giving them lots of outdoor time. I love when he gets wet, his shell turns so bright. All right, baby blue is done soaking. So I dumped some of the water on this concrete just to kind of cool it off because it is pretty warm. Are you trying to bite me? You're so bad. It is pretty warm, but the water definitely cools it off a lot. Here I have his food. This is mostly wild weeds that I collected, obviously. Here's his dandelion. We got some plantain, but I did add a little bit of romaine spring mix on here as well, just to give it some substance. And we are gonna go on and feed him now. See if he'll eat some of it while we're out here. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know if I got too much water. I also brought out Koa to get some sunshine as well. Since he hasn't had an outdoor time in a few days, I thought it would be good to bring him out here and soak him. I would feed him some of these weeds that Blue's eating, but Koa will not touch it. He doesn't do well with veggies. He prefers his worms and strawberries and bell peppers. So that's fine. He's a very, very picky eater. He's my grumpy boy. But I figured he'd enjoy some of the sunshine too. You a good boy, Toto. And little Blue's just munching away. I did trim Blue's little nails today. I didn't have to trim his beak today because I did it a few weeks ago and it hasn't grown any, so that's good. I did just finally get a new Dremel, so I did his nails for the first time and I think they look really good. I just took the little sharp tips off of them you know, just to make sure they weren't getting too long. I don't use the Dremel on his beak. I know some people do, but I feel like it's a little too powerful and a little too strong, and I don't think it's necessary. So I do use other means to trim his beak. If you guys want me to ever make a video on how to maintain your tortoise's beak and nails, let me know. This is the first time I've had to trim his feet. Um, obviously, he's in an indoor setup, so regular beak trims and nail trims are required just to keep them trimmed so that you know they don't get uncomfortable the way that Koa has. I did trim Koa's beak too a few weeks ago. I actually did theirs the same day but I didn't use a Dremel to do it. I just I'm too I guess I'm too afraid to do it but you know Koa's beak and nails were grown out whenever I got him so unfortunately it's really hard to trim them because they were so far gone. So I just kind of have to trim them as I can. But blue is a lot easier to do because he's a good boy. I basically just give him some lettuce and he goes to town eating while I trim his little feet. So we did do that today and they look really good. He's really good about letting me touch his feet and stuff, whereas Koa is not. <laughs> blue is absolutely precious and he's really good about 
letting me touch him and I think he trusts me which I mean that took some time to build you know but he's such a good little boy you love that plantain don't ya it's so good This is about 50% grass, weeds, dandelion, clover, plantain. And then I think this is probably about 50% romaine lettuce and spring mix. Unfortunately, the weeds are kind of slowing down. I know as fall gets here, they're going to stop growing as good for me, which I'm dreading. But I have some other ideas and some things that I'm looking at to feed him during the fall and winter months. So we'll see. But... We're going to feed him weeds and flowers as long as we can, right, bud? You said you go baby. Get it. His birthday is coming up very, very soon. Blue is going to be three years old on August the 16th. I'm so excited, but also sad because my baby's getting older. He's going to be three years old. It's so crazy. You want some dandelion? Watch, he won't touch it. I can lay it in there. What is it? You hungry? No? Oh, I love tortoises so much. Give me all the baby tortoises. How can something be this cute? Seriously, so freaking precious. My favorite animal in the world, hands down, right here. My toodness, boo boo. You're so beautiful. Toe is beautiful too. Does that feel good, Toe? You getting a good soak? He's like, please just put me back in my enclosure. <laughs> Why are you so gumpy? Why are you so gumpy today? Boo, you've eaten a lot. You're almost done. You good boy. I love how he takes more bites even though his mouth is already full. <laughs> like me. Give me as much as I can take. Okay guys, that is it for this video. I know it was very chill and relaxed, but I hope you guys enjoyed all the precious tortoise footage. I love him so much. He's my baby. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I will see you guys next time. Be kind. Bye.